This gets into some fun D&D math. So if you're scared of math, bear with me. I promise this will be educational. So the fundamental math of 5th edition D&D assumes that a character who is good at something will succeed 65% of the time. You're going to succeed on an 8. So at level 1, you'll typically have a plus 3 ability modifier in your primary ability, a plus 2 proficiency bonus. Add that together, you get plus 5. So 8 plus 5 is 13. So the expected AC for a monster at level 1 is 13. So that progression stays on track through the entire level range. The armor classes for a monster of your level increase at the times when you're expected to increase your ability modifier and when you're expected to increase your proficiency bonus. So the expectation is always that you will hit a typical CR appropriate monster on an 8, assuming you're staying on the fundamental math progression. Now you might fall behind that fundamental math if you're taking feats or something, especially in the 2014 rules where a lot of feats didn't include an ability score increase. With that 65% assumption, we can use that to calculate your expected damage per round, or DPR. So essentially just calculate your average damage, multiply it by 0.65, that is how much damage you are expected to do 